Hello everyone, this is Joseph Notch here and welcome to the third online international meeting for users of open phones. So welcome. Today is the day when the event starts with this presentation and here I would like to give you a little bit of an introduction to the talks that you can look forward to. So this is the schedule. As I already mentioned in my previous video, there is going to there are going to be six presentation, the first one being this introduction, of course, and I'm going to publish the videos at seven in the morning, Central European summertime. And the second talk is going to be published at one in the afternoon again, Central European uh, uh, summertime. And so um, uh, the talks we're go are going to be distributed uh, on to Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. And you don't have to register, just check out the videos here on my channel. And as you uh, see, I'm not giving a talk this year because I thought that I don't have to be always in the spotlight. It is about your work. So I am leaving you the presentations. Okay, so the first presentation is going to be on uh, single node and multi node uh, simulations. So I, I just uh, copied a slide out of the presentation here. And in this video, you will see how you can run an open form simulation on two different nodes, now, which means, for example, two uh, separate workstations and how you can utilize the combined power of two workstations for one simple simulation for, for one single simulation. So the second one is going to be on post processing with plotly dash. And here you, uh, you will see a possibility on a web based post processor of open foam and for a test the my uh, blender Suzanne uh, competition case was taken uh, for the calculation of the drag coefficient of the monkey head and this is, uh, the results are going to present that. So if you are looking for po uh, post-processing tool for, for example, the CD value or something similar, then check out this video. And the next is going to be on aluminum alloy profile extrusion, which is very interesting. Here, uh, um, technical results are going to be presented how OpenFoam can be utilized to simulate uh, these kinds of flows and also a little bit about uh, the about programming and what uh, was changed in uh, the source code of, open, of an OpenFoam solver. So this is very interesting. Then uh, we are going to hear something about injection molding. And this is particularly interesting for me because you might know that I've been working for years on a solver for injection molding. So here you can see one slide out of the presentation where you see the filling process of a tensile test specimen compared um, an open foam solver compared to a commercial solver and just to see the differences. And then in the end, uh, we are going to hear something about gear splash lubrication by Matt Wigmore. And I'm particularly um, excited about this because Matt is one of my patrons and together we were able to set up his problem in open foam on, uh, on Patreon, and he was able to generate some very cool results. Here you can see the gear moving and the um, velocity distribution and he compares uh, commercial software for this kind of problems and open foam and you will see what the results look like. Okay, so this is again the schedule. So please tune in and watch the videos if you're interested. I hope that you like this event and that you will enjoy the videos. With that, I would like to thank you for watching and listening. And I hope to see you next time.